Full Spectrum Warrior, it's a simulator that simulates uh, squad-based tactics. Even though it's a third-person game, you're not actually playing as a character in the game. You are more or less giving commands, um, sort of like a, a real-time strategy game. Unlike America's Army, the game was created out of a collaboration between a private gaming company and a government-sponsored think tank called the Institute for Creative Technologies. ICT is uh, USC's Institute for Creative Technologies. It's a university-affiliated research center funded by the U.S. Army. The Institute, which opened in 1999 with a $45 million grant, was designed to bring the military to games and games to the military. It was a way to uh, create a center that would bring the best of entertainment, money from the military, and create products that could be used for both sectors. Although Full Spectrum Warrior was eventually released as a commercial title, it was originally made as a tactical trainer for U.S. Army infantry. The soldier of the 21st century has to know a lot more than just his weapon. He has to know all the systems that he's integrated with, how he talks to the UAVs and the remote drones. It's a much more complicated system that he's part of now.